previously on the Slider 1995. We got Virtual Fighter 2 for the Sega Genesis just to see how much of a downgrade it was and it really is. But little did I know that it could get much worse than that. Released in 1996 for the Sega Game Gear, Virtua Fighter Animation is a game that follows the events of the anime at the same time that was airing on television. I've watched a few episodes of it, and it's pretty cool. It's kind of funny, but also serious, and there's a thing to it that all Virtua Fighter games have had is that there's the actual focus on real martial arts, and they show at certain points, like in a fight, it'll stop, and then it'll show the person doing a move, and it'll show what it is and where it's from. It's actually... Wait a second. Where have I seen this before? <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm actually pretty surprised that I dig this, because I'm not really into anime much at all. But anyway, I'm here to talk about the game, not the TV show. Uh, anyway, the game is actually pretty good, considering the hardware limitations. It's very hard to pull off a Virtua Fighter-esque game on something as limited as the Game Gear. But the game itself is pretty cool. I mean, the controls they kind of lag but at the same time can be fluent as well it's hard to explain the game gives you the choice of six different characters and if you're playing the story mode with each level except for one which is the battle with cage because you face him a second time each person you defeat you get another character to play as as the game goes along and out of all these characters, I found Jackie to be my favorite, but he's usually my favorite in all the games anyway. But surprisingly, uh, Jeffrey is not in this. Jeffrey is a character that was in the first Virtual Fighter game, but whatever. Um, when it comes down to gameplay, it's interesting. When you have the character select screen, it gives you three options for normal, large, and real time. Uh, normal shows the fight and it's really zoomed out and large has it zoomed in and real time is a combination of both where if you get really close if you get close to the other person it'll go to large otherwise it zooms out which is kind of cool um overall this game was pretty good considering what it was on um whether i'd recommend it or not i'm not completely sure if i would but I had fun playing it. The game was really short, though. Like, I beat it in maybe a half hour. But it was, you know, it was fun. It's another game I can, you know, check off the list of games I've played. So, if you want to give it a shot, go for it. I mean, I gave it a shot because I'm trying to get all the Virtua Fighter games and um, side games. So, it was worth checking out. My curiosity has been... You know, I was able to check that out for my own curiosity. But yeah, check it out if you want, I guess. And thanks for watching.